This video will demonstrate how to connect Orion pipe using the Orion Fuse Electro Fusion System. The video is not intended to replace published installation instructions or the experience of a trained product installer. Please refer to the installation instructions for further information and product warnings. Consult local codes before beginning any work. Before beginning an outdoor installation, take note of the weather. Extreme conditions like wind, rain, snow, or excessive cold can make proper fusions hard or impossible to complete. Plug the Ryan fuser into a dedicated power source and start up the system. At startup, the unit will perform a self-test to confirm the system is calibrated. If the due date is passed or is within the life of your project, stop and contact your Orion representative for instruction on how to get your machine properly calibrated. Material preparation is essential to achieve a quality fuse. Start by cleaning all field cut pipe ends. Following the coupling insertion depth chart, mark the coupling insertion depth from the end of the pipe or fitting to ensure that the coupling is properly positioned during the fusion cycle. Using a marker, mark the pipe according to the coupling insertion depth guide. Using 60 grit emery cloth, abrade the marked ends of the pipe and fitting to remove the natural sheen of the plastic. After abrasion, clean all joint surfaces thoroughly with isopropyl alcohol. Note, cleaning the fitting and pipe ends of all dirt and debris is essential to creating a quality joint. Ensure all pipe ends and fittings are cleaned thoroughly with isopropyl alcohol before proceeding. Failure to do so could result in a leak. Insert the prepared ends of the pipe into the hubs of the Ryan Fuse CF coupling. Ensure the joint is properly supported throughout the fusion cycle and afterwards as the joint cools to ambient temperature. With the Ryan Fuse unit powered on, connect the lead cables to the coupling. On the controller, highlight the proper fitting style and press the start button to confirm your selection. Next, use the arrows to select the proper size of the joint being fused and press start to confirm the selection. The unit will then ask if a preheat cycle is required. Select standard and press start. The screen will then display verify welding parameters and an audible beep will sound to indicate the fusion unit is ready to begin welding. Verify the data displayed on the screen matches the joint being fused. If the information is incorrect, press the stop slash back button to return to any of the previous menu options to correct the fusion parameters. Once verified, press start to begin the fusion weld. The Ryan fuser will begin to weld. Make sure the pipe and coupling are fully supported throughout the fusion process and up to 10 minutes after completion, depending on the size of the pipe. After the cycle is completed, another audible beep will sound to indicate the weld is done. An equal consistent beeping indicates the joint was successful. An irregular beeping pattern indicates an error has occurred during the fusion cycle. Remove the lead cables and mark the fused coupling with the fusion number from the machine. Note, do not stress newly fused joints until fully cooled to ambient, typically within 10 to 20 minutes depending on the size. A successful weld completion screen does not eliminate the need for system leak testing. 